tonight to the closing of Ames stores across the country. If you're a discount shopper, you have lost yet another option. But as Action News reporter Emily Ryan shows us, many people blame it on having too many choices. As they leave with carts full of deals, many shoppers at this Ames and Robinson Town Center still can't believe it's closing. I thought they were doing good. Usually I come in, you gotta wait a while. Ames isn't the only store going out of business here. So is Farmore. Nearby, a Kmart Supercenter remains open, although other Kmarts have closed. That's all we went to is Ames and Kmart. But now we're seeing so many of these other companies that's springing up with, that had the same products, and it's so much competition today. This Duquesne University business professor agrees, saying the market is oversaturated. But with all this tremendous number of stores, what ends up happening is the weaker, the less financially strong, the older stores tend to die away. And that's what's happening with Ames. You don't have to look far from this Ames to find the competition. Walmart, Target, Sam's Club, and Costco, all luring away customers. I'll go where I have to go to get what I need, I guess. We as Pittsburghers shouldn't panic. It is a national trend. And I think we're going to get down to keeping the stronger, more financially viable, the stores that offer us better prices and better merchandise. In Robinson Township, Emily Ryan, Channel 4 Action News.